Nicky Hawkins outside Stanford Bridge, West Ham fan TV. Dom, um, I think a bit of an arse scoreline tonight, to be honest. I agree. I do agree, Nick, but uh, we paid the price for not turning up in the first half. And when you're on top, you need to score, and we didn't score, and we paid the price. So when you come up against a team like Chelsea, much as they're probably by their standards under underachieving this season, you have to perform in two halves, and we didn't. So. To be fair, I, I think I think look, Balbuena come back in. I think we looked a lot more solid in, at the back. Um, as you said, a bit of a poor first half. Bit of, we, we were standing still. I mean, for the goal, we were standing around watching. Balbuena's our best defender. I've said this all season. Yeah. Um, it's no coincidence to how bad we've been defensively since he's been out injured. I don't know why it's taken him this long to come back into the team. Uh, Ogbonna's been all right recently, but. I don't think he was very good tonight. I think he left the back line far too exposed. I don't know. I think I, I would. I don't know why he's put Diop on the bench. I can't understand for the love of God why he's done that. Um, we did. We didn't play football the first half. You know. We. You know. You, you, you come away to Chelsea. Fine. You're gonna. You're gonna soak. You've got to soak up pressure and park the bus a bit. But we didn't look like we were trying first half. And we always seem to play well against Chelsea, but we didn't that first half. Second half, I don't know why he took Hernandez off. Uh, I think Hernandez was a bit starved of service, but I think Snodgrass made a bit of an impact, got some good balls in. Well, listen, we had chances to equalise. We came close three times, and you're right, 2 0 is harsh, but the difference is, mate, they've got a world class player in Hazard, and we've got a winger in Anderson who prefers to showboat than actually do stuff with the ball. Although, to be fair, he was a bit better second half. I mean, and I think on I think on Abbott's was better today. I think he works really hard. Talking about Hazard, mate, every time he got the ball, we just look frightened of him. Yeah, um, I think to blame the first goal on a defensive error is harsh, because I think that's an absolute bit of genius by him to score. Silver lining, mate, he's got me some dream team points, but that's the only good thing to come out of this, you know. It's fucking... I hate these bastards. It's never nice losing to them, but you've got to remember that despite, you know, by their standards, the season they're having, they are miles better than us. Mm. We're miles off where we want to be, and it looks as if it's looked for a while, Nick, that the season's done, as far as these players are aware. And... Uh, as far as I'm aware, I can't wait for it to end, and the players look like they can't wait for it to end. I think we'll get one more win this season. Uh, like I said, I can't see us winning away. So we've got three hard away games. Um, I think one more win, and I think you say the season's petering out. But look, listen, we, we weren't too bad tonight. Much, much performance-wise, an improvement from the Everton game. You can't fault the effort. No, you can't fault the effort. Um, yeah. But listen, against any opposition, if you don't turn up for one half, you're going to get punished. Listen. We, we've shown that against weak opposition like Wimbledon. You need to turn up for every minute in football. And if you don't, you get punished. And that's what's happened tonight. But Man United next. Whatever. 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 Season's finishing anyway. All right, mate. Thank you very much. Cheers. Thank you.